Hi guys, I'm back with another video. I hope you guys are having an awesome day today. Anyway, I was inspired by Bella D Designs. Uh, I saw her decorate her dole bowl and she did such a beautiful job. She made it look so pretty. And I just remember that I have one too. It's not quite the same shape or style, but I have never used it in any of my decor. So I thought, you know what, let me go ahead. I should pull mine out and decorate it. So, I so if you're interested in seeing how I decorated my dough bowl, and I hope that you are, just stay tuned. Okay guys, here is my dough bowl. It's white inside and on the outside is just a nice um, deep reddish wine color. So that's how it looks. So I'll be using that. I have a few pumpkins that I'm gonna be using. One that says thankful and one that says blessed. I have a little cute fall sign that says harvest wishes and a nice candle. This candle says glazed pumpkin. That's how it looks. And then some florals. I've got some leaves here and some over here. Also, I'm using some uh, ribbon that I got from the Dollar Tree. Here's red and brown. Okay, we're gonna get started with these two pieces of ribbon that I've already cut in half to the, you know, the length that I want them. I'm just going to drape it across the bowl like so. The other one will go the other way. Okay, the next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add some greenery to the ends here like so. If I can get that under there, that'd be good. Put that there. And the other one on the other side. Like that. Okay, next we're gonna add the leaf florals. And I'm just gonna place them in here um, the way I feel that it should be placed. You may have to change it up, but that's okay. So I put that one laying that way. And I put this one laying that way. And then I have one more. kind of like laying in the center. Next, I have this little garland that I'm using as well, and I'm just gonna lay that some kind of way in the, right in the center there, just to give it a little more, um, a, fuller, a fuller look. Okay, next, I'm gonna use one of the pumpkins and put it over here. Now guys, I may not use all of the pumpkins that I showed you, um, because it might not need it, but it's a trial and error. Just have to try it and see how it looks. Okay, I think that looks cute. Okay, that's looking nice as it is. I don't know if I wanna add anything else, but let's see. I just might, we'll see. I'll take this one here, place it like that, which I don't know if I'm gonna like. Hmm. Now, I'm not feeling this because this is kind of mashing everything down. I'm not sure if we're gonna use it. <laughs> then that one will be right there. Who knows, it might turn out okay. And this third one here, let's see, where am I gonna put it? Hmm. 
do I like or do I not? Let's work with it a little bit and see if I can perfect it. Hmm. Next, I am using my candle. I just place it right there. Kind of move this back a bit. Making sure that I can read the fragrance. And then my cute little sign that says Harvest Wishes. Now let me take a look and see if I really, really like it. And here is the finished look of my dough bowl. Actually, I swapped out the small pumpkin that I had right here for this big one because I thought this would look much nicer. Bella, I'm so glad that I got inspired by watching you make yours. Thank you so much. And then I had it some, a couple of uh, pumpkins in the front here. I think it turned out really pretty and I'm very glad that I saw her do this so that I could do one too. Cause I have never styled this dough bowl ever, you guys. It's been sitting in my hallway. I never put it to use, so I'm so glad. Well, that's gonna do it for this video, you guys. I hope that you like it. Please give me a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not yet a member of the family, and I will talk to you guys later. Thank you all for watching. Bye.